You know what? I I don't want to get married again. I don't I don't want to get married again. It was a stupid idea in the first place. Life is full of nothing but pain and misery. It was stupid to even look for something to try to work out. You're overreacting, Martin. Eventually I'll get this thing out of my eye, and eventually your pain that's, will That's be. not the point. Something else awful will happen. It always happens. Are you ready for your order? No. I'll come back. Fine. You know, he's right. You get your hopes up and something awful happens. Why, just last week, I, uh, I got this call from a representative of Meg McMahon, and he was like, you want a million dollars. So I, I was going to quit my job. You know, But I misheard him, you know. He said I might win a million dollars if I subscribe to some magazine. So I bought TVI for 36 weeks. And, and then my, my apartment got robbed. What are the odds? And they stole my TV. So I don't have a TV, but I'll still be in TVI. That's all very sad. I wonder, though. Possibly not talk to us quite so much this evening. Tomorrow. I'm just saying, when I came here, I didn't realize that this was going to be one of those talky chatty restaurants. What? I would like to have a conversation with my ex wife. But with you, I like to say hello and goodbye and here's my order now. Oh, you want your order? It's difficult to understand. I'm not difficult to understand. I would just like some. Courtesy and decorum from the people whose job it is to serve me. Just bring him the check. What? Martin, I'm remembering why I divorced you. You're really horrible. You should be in therapy. Ha! I'd like to be in therapy, but I can't afford it. Where's the manager? I want this man fired! Just bring him the check. I'm going to a fast food restaurant. Where's the manager? We don't have a manager, but uh, I can get you the cook. 